no. Vincent. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Hello. We're Welcome. very excited today. Woo-hoo! Today's the day. The sun is shining. The birds are singing. <laughs> and the hatch is still locked. Yes. You know why? Why? We were watching the season one finale three-part episode of Lost. Woo! So we have been planning this in the background. We have been each watching the show up to the end of the last part of the first season. Yes. And we just released a podcast. Our first podcast too, we might add. And it's all of our thoughts and feelings about the first season of Lost so far. We had a lot of thoughts and feelings. It's quite the episode. It's a long episode. (laughs) So if you want to (laughs) go and listen to that podcast, you can go check that out and hear all of our thoughts leading up to the finale. Yes. Which we're going to do a reaction to today. Yes. And for those of you who did not watch the or listen to the podcast before coming on here, Mm -hmm. I have not seen the finale. We filmed the podcast before we have seen this. So this is all fresh for me. So we did do the first couple episodes of Lost in another video. And in that we explained, I have seen all of Lost. Yes. Christina has seen only season five and six. Yes, I saw the last two seasons, like the dummy that I am. And I am proud of it. Thank you, chirpers, in the comments. It is fine. I live with my decision. But now you get to experience it. But now I get to go back and experience it, and the ending will make so much more sense now. So before we jump in, we did talk about your theories before in the podcast. But do you want to just give a quick little, what do you think is going to happen? Yes. So I think this raft is a really bad idea. Mm -hmm. Um, So I'm thinking that in these last three episodes, we're going to address the raft Mm -hmm. and we're going to address the hatch. And I think there's going to be some casualties because there's way too many people in this group of people right now. And a lot of them don't even have a name. There very well may be. All right. So for those of you who don't know anything about Lost, just really quick, there was a plane crash on an island and we're with the survivors and we're learning about how they all got there and what their lives were all like beforehand through Mm -hmm. flashbacks in the episode. So we're going to watch Exodus part one, two and three today. And the synopsis from IMDb, just for the first part. Mm -hmm. is the French woman arrived at the camp with a dire warning about a group of survivors known as the Others. What? Frenchie's back? So that may have given you some thoughts on where this episode's leading. Cool beans! (laughs) Into the forest we go! Yes. Hey? You've been chomping at the bit. Oh, I'm excited. (laughs) Wanting to see how this all resolves. I'm like at the edge of my seat, like, let's (laughs) go! Interesting note that the title is Exodus. Yes. Exodus, all three parts are called Exodus. Power Rangers! Sorry, (laughs) I got excited. I'm going to hide behind this tree. Hopefully she won't see me (laughs) with her track knowledge. This tree that's perfectly Walt-sized. I will hide behind. Say your line. The others are coming. There you go. And I'm just going to cut to the lost thing. Yep, knew it. I die. Interesting. Okay. How are you feeling now? No, I just saw a name credit. Was this the direction you thought this was going to go? <laughs> no, it's not. I do one, two, three, lift. On three or after three? On three. After three? On three? After three. Three, three. <laughs> <laughs> Let's all stare. This is very productive. You got to know all your favorite characters before this season finale kicks off. Oh, yes. All the characters with all their names. My dad died. How? Is that the normal question you ask people? Yeah, this is kind of a rough line of questioning. No ring because you're single or because you don't like wearing one? <laughs> Christina goes quiet. Wow. Wants to know. We'll have the next drink on the plane, okay? You're not in the same aisle. How are you going to do that? Just going to walk down and have a drink standing in the aisle? Well, she says she's at the back of the plane, so she's clearly not on the island. So, unless you want to blow up. Good thing we have the science teacher here to help with dynamite. And knows how to use it, too. Yeah. They're doing some interesting experiments in their classes. <laughs> I want to be in his class. Oh, well, this Charlie is scene. very... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they really they were... They cranked up the spicy rating. Trying to do something with that shot, eh? <laughs> yep. I know your father. Wait, I need to tell you. Your papa and I. <laughs> I'm your brother. <laughs> <laughs> He's a better doctor than he'll ever be. 
this is a tender bro moment right now. It really is. It's a bro moment and a half. Yeah. Oh, I love them. Oh, man. <laughs> Jack's like, hold it in, man. <laughs> and I think she's telling herself she needs it. The guy working security is like, this is a long backstory to be telling me right now. He's like, I didn't even know this. I just want to know why you want five guns. <laughs> He didn't get to say bye to Sawyer. Oh no! <laughs> Dramatic, running along the beach, trying to say goodbye. His hair, all over. Wispy. Apparently, he's always going to be shirtless from now on. Too. And that's <laughs> written in his contract. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they should have gone exploring a little more. It looks pretty nice in different parts of the island. Right. Would you mind watching my bag for a moment? I'll be right back. Wow, meet cute. You could see the sparks flying between them. This the black rock were you expecting it to be a ship well it's going to be a volcano but it's a ship that would have been quite the change up right? <laughs> look into a volcano <laughs> it's a good thing they had this talk before he just left yeah right? <laughs> he didn't say anything <laughs> uh, uh, awkward oh, no. so awkward <laughs> do we hug do we shake a hand we don't know See, they're really spending a lot of time in part one showing everybody all together, mm -hmm. having all these nice feelings for each other. Yeah, then everything's going to hit the fan. <laughs> <laughs> like, I understand, but it's quite a journey to take a child with you on this raft. Yeah, I don't think it was probably the best decision to take Walt. But Michael didn't want to leave him. I mean, I get it, but... Go back! Oh, <laughs> oh no! Swims right past Shannon. <laughs> <laughs> How far are we getting? Waiting for it. Can't you hear the music? It's uplifting. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Commercial break. Let's well, gonna change everything. Oh. <laughs> That's it. First episode. <laughs> Rip. How you feeling? Something unexpected at sea surprises those on the raft. I told you this was a horrible idea. How are you feeling? I'm just waiting for the punch. Just waiting for <laughs> the it. The punch. Told you. There's something going to happen with this raft. Like, it's not going to end well. Carry her child to the caves. That's what she needs. Come on, Charlie. You got this. I believe in you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're just standing and staring. Let's actually go do something. They're in awe. They okay, were but like expecting. time's against them. They weren't expecting a pirate ship. Well, it's a pirate ship. <laughs> Blackbeard's on board. And so is Captain Morgan. Are those the only pirates you know? <laughs> no, I mean, there's Jack Sparrow too. Well, but what okay. I'm saying is the rum's all gone and we know who to blame. Was this the explosive finale you were looking for? <laughs> and then my third wife, she says, get this, she says. How many wives have you had? <laughs> Holy. <Or early. laughs> An unstable explosive known to man. I'm expecting him to go kaboom. Because nitroglycerin is extremely temperamental. So we just. Yep. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I was so waiting for it. Was he on your list of someone not surviving the finale? Yeah, he didn't have a name until like two episodes ago, so. I don't know. It seems to be pretty smooth sailing. I don't trust it. <laughs> Land ho! JK. It's the island again. They went in circles. Singing Bob Molly. Oh. <laughs> Sometimes Sawyer is just like rude to a fault. Or yeah, it's like, right? No. no. No, I was not. <laughs> How did you make an accusation like that? No. So the explosives was a fail. How you feeling? What's plan B? <laughs> we just saw a dude get blown to smithereens. <laughs> he also picked one that was like the most, had the most uh, stuff on the outside yeah, of the it. Yeah, the most like... residue. <laughs> <laughs> so I was going to have a laugh. Whenever you put these two on screen together, it just feels like something important. Mm -hmm. When did I do that? It wasn't a polar bear. Mm. It was a Claire Bear. Claire Bear. Care Bear. Not so caring. Care Bear stare. <laughs> the memories come flooding back. Yeah, the one person who needs to remember something right now. Finally. <laughs> Why would you pull it out right now? Yeah, there? honestly, right? <laughs> Just keep it in your pocket. Poor timing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it was baby kidnapping on your list of things for it this was season not, finale. I forgot about the baby, to be honest. <laughs> totally well, forgot. He doesn't have a name yet. That's true. It's on my list as Claire's baby because yes. baby does not have a name yet. Turn a pet. Turn a pet. Yes, sorry. Turn a pet. Looks like it's you and me, Kate. You chose wrong, Jack. Mm -hmm. Your hero complex will not be fulfilled today. Not today, sir. 
Why are you gonna kill him? Because I need to. Why? <laughs> this is such like a child I asking know. questions. I love it. They just ask. They're so inquisitive. They're like, why <laughs> this? Why that? They just have to know everything. But why? But why? You gotta get turnip head, Aaron. <laughs> to the black smoke. Da -da -da -da. One does not simply walk to the black smoke. To the black rock, maybe. The black rock. Black smoke? No way. No way. Dogs fly in the luggage compartment all the time. I don't trust that. No, it just sounds sad. I am not flying with my dogs. Unless they can sit on a seat with me, they're not flying. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's a little lock cameo. I really enjoyed that. <laughs> that was great. <laughs> Didn't need to say anything. <laughs> just rolls on by. Turn it gradually. Nothing sharp, okay? <laughs> Goes off the edge. Yeah. <laughs> like, woo! Don't do it, Tim. All wrong. My precious. <laughs> Call a moment. I'm channeling Elijah Wood right now. <laughs> Clean socks, soap, and Twinkies. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I like Twinkies too. <laughs> bonding over yeah, Twinkies. What a bonding moment. Dun dun dun! Really hard cut there. <laughs> that was a really hard cut. Normally they've like made them pretty, uh, I pretty think easy. This is supposed to be just one long episode. Yeah. Snake, snake. Nope. Ooh, smoky smoke. A little, <laughs> a little whisper. Whisper, whisper. So Jack ditched his backpack. Locks doing no it. No one else did. Except Locks Lock, walking but he's forward. like venturing towards it. Kate completely forgot that she had dynamite in her backpack. She's just booking it. No, no, it's in my pack. Oh, you slew off the bag. Freaking knew it. That's the hero complex, Jack. Uh. You like that he still has his handcuff? Yeah, his bracelet. He's just <laughs> rocking it. I'm fine. But it's in a coconut. Yeah, she made you a whole thing of tea. He's just trying to help. Charlie will bring your baby back. Baby, come back. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, saw an opportunity. We need to put pressure on it. And the pressure. Didn't know this was the musical episode of Lost. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's gotta have one. I don't think you're meant to make this flight, do you? Trying really hard. Oh my god. For you him. Make it. <sighs> oh my god, Hurley, I'm stressed for you. <laughs> <laughs> At least he's got sneakers. He was thinking ahead on the sneakers. We're spending a good chunk of the finale of season one with Hurley running around an airport. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of flashbacks. Mm -hmm. I think they're just, it feels like filler at this point. It's comical, but it feels like filler. They want you to know how everybody was right before the flight. <laughs> oh, this guy, he's just such a happy-go-lucky guy, honestly. <laughs> well, he's not lucky. <laughs> Did it for a $23,000 reward. Mm. Ooh. Numbers have meaning in this show. <laughs> oh, so much meaning. We shouldn't be this close to each other, Jack. We blow up, we blow up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think we've accepted that fact at this point. Because you're a man of science. Oh, a man oh! of science. A man of faith. Oh, I'm a man of faith. Oh! <laughs> Matt, I think we wrote this. <laughs> There's your thesis for all of your essays about loss. There you go, science versus faith. The island chose you too, Jack. I choose you. You specifically, Jack, were chosen. Boone was a sacrifice that the island demanded. Damn. Whoa. Completely discarded him. Oh my god. Now the question is, do we think the dynamite's gonna work or not? Do you want it to work? You don't know what's in the hatch. Yeah, I don't know what's in the hatch. But I'm kind of nervous just with the time clocking that was says right now. They're gonna like blow it up and then boom, finale, and done. But they're setting up a lot of stuff. Like, you're setting up, they get Claire's baby. Mm-hmm. And you're setting up this hatch. Mm -hmm. And you still have the wrap doing its thing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's a lot going on right now. Yeah. I don't know if they're going to tie it up in time. Zooky out at night. It'd be so cold. It'd be cold. It'd be so dark. I think they're underestimating how, like, cozy this is. Because, like, you'd have, like, like, a water splashing about. You guys are so lucky that, like, it's really calm right now. Something's out there. Yeah, but you don't know what it is. It could be a ship. It could be a whale. <laughs> the only two options. <laughs> the only two options. A ship or a whale. 
I thought it was going to end there for a second. I was going to be really <laughs> You're upset. really freaking out about the ending. <laughs> I was going to be so mad if it ended there. Like, are you freaking kidding me? That is not an ending. I am not satisfied with that. <laughs> At least you don't have to wait like six months in between seasons. Oh my God. Could you? Oh, yeah. That was the worst when you have to wait for episodes to come out. Mm-hmm. The others said they were coming for the boy. Well, which one? What do you mean? <laughs> they come for Charlie? <laughs> no, for um, Walt. Oh. He's the only other kid. That's true. If they're being, like, if it has to be a child specifically, it could be Aaron or it could be Walt. Yeah. But they didn't know that Walt was going to go off the island. But I still think the island won't let them leave. So they're going to come back at some point. They're going to be dragged back. Or they're going to circle and think they find land, but it's actually still the <laughs> island. They're and just like, going oh, shit. Back in we went in circles. I'll do it. Hero complex. Jack, take a break. <laughs> Honestly, it must be so exhausting. Just for a second, let somebody else do something. <laughs> <sighs> now she's, oh no. Bad omen. It's a bad omen. You thought it was going to end there? I thought it was going to end there too, yeah. <laughs> I was like, mm, there it is. Somebody had to get a win this episode. <laughs> Something good had to long? happen. For how long? <laughs> <laughs> how long is this win? Claire's with the baby again. <laughs> <laughs> See, everyone made eye contact. They all had a special connection before the flight even <laughs> took off. You gotta Still wait. Still don't know. <laughs> Still don't know. Ah, uh, they got it open. <laughs> I was kind of hoping that it, they it would blow it up and it still didn't open. <laughs> I would have just that would have been like the extra punch to to lock that it kind of felt like he needed. So bad omen with the boat feeling you had panned out. Yeah, that panned out <laughs> pretty poorly. For yeah, Walt. honestly, like now there's like all three of them are in the water. The raft is blown up mm -hmm. and Walt has been taken away by smugglers. Yes. So. So I'm interested to see how that pans out. Yeah. <laughs> if, I like if they're even going to focus on that. Because I feel there's like so many different things they're trying to focus on right now. Mm -hmm. One thing you can say about Lost, there's always mysteries mm -hmm. about what's going on. They're going to, they're setting things up and then they just kind of forget about it. Like that's what I'm kind of like nervous. Like now that they've separated Walt from everybody mm -hmm. and now he's also no longer on the island. Right. So are they going to you know follow that like how does walt does he reunite with michael does i know what happens with Jin and sawyer so how do they go to where they need to be yeah yeah you can get sawyer and Jin to where they need to be but then are they just gonna forget about mike mike and walt or are they gonna or are they gonna just finish that mm -hmm. and then get back to the stuff on the island now that the hatch is open like who's gonna go down the hatch and like investigate that and i feel like that's probably what season two is gonna be heavily like figuring what's in the hatch at least the first portion yeah Definitely not as many like people died as I was expecting. No, you were really. I was expecting yeah. it to be like Game of Thrones, like Battle of Winterfell, no. like you know, big body count. Mm -hmm. So I'm interested to see how it pans out over the next like three seasons with all these other people. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and what happens to all these no names essentially? Yeah, and I can think back and be like, oh, this season's about this, and this season's about this. So like they do kind of keep like a an arc throughout each season. Mm -hmm. So that does make it easier to remember what happens like i can tell you what happens in season two because i remember mm -hmm. because it is like about a certain thing mm -hmm. so it does always like a general theme or like something happens where you're like oh that's the season where this happens so yeah i feel like kind of like what you expect like it is like a drama mystery there's some sci-fi peppered in there's a lot of comedy in it which i wasn't expecting like re-watching the like watching the first season it was definitely a very comedic mm -hmm. at a lot of points where it's like this is supposed to be serious but like i'm laughing really hard right now so i found it more funny than like suspense yeah that but it was enjoyable the scene when they take wall is pretty yeah grim. and that was kind of like i'm like guys why are we shouting you don't know who these people are mm -hmm. why are you telling them your whole life story do we trust these people yeah they were just excited to see somebody else i get and i 100 i get that i really do but you also should be questioning, why are you out in the middle of nowhere? You know, where are we? Mm -hmm. Like, that should have been like the first question, you know? It would be like, um, 
who are you? Where are you from? Well, Michael asked and they just ignored him. <laughs> so. Well, yeah, because they're not going to disclose any information. And all Michael did was just kept blabbing about like, oh, yeah, this is who we are. This is what happened to us. Like, like oh, my God, Michael, just shut up. So I think we can agree you're enjoying it enough so far. You're going to keep watching. <laughs> yes, I am definitely going to keep watching. Mm -hmm. Well, I'd say anyone out there who hasn't watched Lost, I'd say really give it a try at this point. Uh -huh. Just to see how you feel watching it. Because I think... Even if some people didn't like the ending, I think the journey there is worth it. Yeah, Just, it's definitely. a fun show to watch. Mm -hmm. It's intriguing. Well, and that was my whole thing too. Is like I knew how it ended, and I didn't understand the ending, and a lot of people just didn't like it. So it kind of put me off, like because there was multiple times where it would like pop up in my feed, being like, "Most recommended watch show. Like you mm -hmm. should watch this." And I was like, "Do I really want to? Like I know how it ends. It didn't end well." But like having like now sat down and watched it, I'm like, no, honestly, like it's kind of worth it to rewatch the ending and maybe it'll have like a different, you know, it'll your, make your more feelings. sense or I'll have a different feeling towards it. I mean, I could still hate it, but I mean, getting there will be still entertaining at the least. But even like you watching this season now, you understand why so many people were into the show when mm -hmm. it came out. So no, 100%. It's definitely one of those like you. you you're like setting your timer. You're like, I'm not doing anything at this time because I'm watching the show. Yeah. So I think it's a loss is the better show to watch all at once. Mm -hmm. And you can pick up on little things that even in the first season, they start talking about that pays off later. So mm -hmm. yeah, definitely. There was things that I flagged of like, this could be important. Mm -hmm. This is going to come back later. You should remember this. Mm -hmm. Don't tell me what I can't do. Don't tell me what I can't do. <laughs> Don't scream it. Feel it. Body it. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for watching with us. It's been a blast and a half. Had a really good time. As always, you could like this video or subscribe. Even better. If you want to see something for us to watch in the future, like a movie or a TV show, please let us know in the comments. And we'll get on that right away for you. Yeah, yeah. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs>